And now, allow me to introduce the master of terror, the king of nightmares, Jack Skellington! Bravo, Jack! Bravo! Those ghosts will be a big hit at this year's Halloween. Thank you, thank you. But their movement still needs work. It's not scary enough. I want to strike bone-chilling terror. I'm going to consult the doctor. Then I'll go attend to the decorations. I don't understand. Maybe the guidance system was damaged in the explosion. Nonsense. My devices are always perfect. Oh, I've got it. Why, of course. The heartless need a heart. Doctor, do you think we can add a heart to that device? Certainly. A heart's not all that complicated. Ah, let's get to work. To make a heart, First, take a container with a lock. We need the key to this thing first! My, that was amazing! Uh, and you are... Sora! Well done, Sora! I'd like you to be a part of this year's Halloween. What's this Heartless doing here? Oh, the Heartless came to town just recently. What's frustrating is I can't get them to dance with me. So, the doctor and I are trying to improve the guidance system. He's quite a genius. Okay, doctor, let's continue. The ingredients for a heart. Pulse. Emotion. Terror. Fear. Hope and despair. Mix them all together, and we have a heart. Maybe we're missing some ingredients. Let's try adding memory. Sally? Sally! Good for nothing girl. Don't know why I bothered creating her. Sally's got the memory we need. See if you can track her down. No problem. Sora, would you like to come along? Sure. Jack! Jack! We have a major crisis! The Heartless are completely out of control! We can't stop them! Hmm, maybe our experiment triggered something. Everything will be fine, Mayor. You have nothing to worry about. Zero, have you seen Sally anywhere? Huh? Is something wrong, Jack? No, everything's going great. We're going to have the best Halloween ever. All we need now is your memory. Memory? You mean this? Jack. I have a bad feeling about this. Why don't you try something else? There's still time. Nothing could beat what I've got planned. Once we give the Heartless a heart, they'll dance just as I envision it. Trust me, you're going to love it. <laughs> ah! 
Did you hear that? Yeah, I sure did. A heart. What should we do? Gosh, you really are stupid. Isn't it obvious? Tell Oogie Boogie. <laughs> 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 that bonehead Jack is really making a heart. <laughs> I'll be jiggered. That works for me. Ooh, when I get my hands on that... Well, I've got no hands, but I'm still gonna nab that heart and control the heartlet. <laughs> There you go. This time it's sure to work. Now! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> we lost them. Zero! After them, quick! I knew Oogie Boogie was behind this. You want it? Well then, come on over and get it! Now, let's see if I can get their attention. Oh, hello! It? Nobody disrespects me! Nobody! Sally, why didn't I listen to you? Don't feel bad, Jack. We'll come up with another plan for Halloween. Next time, we'll do it together.
sink, 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 sink. Hi there. What's wrong? Nothing. I just thinking. Oh. I was thinking of how to say goodbye to Pooh. Pooh? Yes. Wait a second. You're Pooh? Yes, I'm Winnie the Pooh. Pooh for short. Who are you? I'm Sora. Oh, hello, Sora. Have you come to say goodbye to Pooh, too? Well, no. Why would I do that? We've only just met. Because everyone's gone away. What do you mean? Well, we all left here in the Hundred Acre Wood. And we'd take walks together. Or play poo sticks. And every day, I'd eat some honey. Oh, just one small smackerel would taste very good right now. But now, everyone is gone. All my friends, and my favorite honey tree, too. Everyone must have gone away while I was napping, I think. So, who knows? Maybe I shall end up going away somewhere as well. But I wonder, how do I say goodbye to myself? Think, think, think. Oh, my tumbly is getting rather rumbly. There's no more honey left. If only the honey tree would visit. Oh, then I could eat my fill. to do. I'm all alone. Pooh. Pooh. Where are you? It's me, Piglet. Be scared. You're looking for Pooh, right? You know Pooh. Ah, oh, you see, I, I have something for him. I have to take it to Pooh right away. <laughs> oh, Pooh! Oh, I believe I smell a delicious something. A something like honey. Pooh! Hello, Piglet. How have you been? Oh, I'm so glad to see you. I thought you'd gone away. I brought what you asked for. <laughs> Thank you, Piglet. Now I can finally have some honey. Really? But, 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 but how? I shall hold on to the balloon and fly like a bee up the honey tree, see? But if you take their honey, won't the bees be angry? Hmm. Oh! Hurry 
is rather funny. What I will do for honey. <laughs> Name's Tigger. T I double G er. That spells Tigger. Well, now, I don't think I've ever seen you before. Hello, Tigger. You've just bounced my new friend, Sora. Hey, Pooh. Say, you're looking mighty uncomfy today. Is that some new exercise? Why, bouncing around is a lot more fun. <sighs> well, why do you bounce around so much, Tigger? Why? Because bouncing's what Tigger's do best! Speaking of which, my bouncing spot has gone and disappeared! So for now, this will be my new bouncing ground! <laughs> Nobody keeps up with Tiggers! Hmm, maybe there's something wrong with my tail. so dark in here. Well, it isn't so bad, I suppose. <laughs> there is plenty of honey. <laughs> Glad we're all together again. <laughs> I didn't know what to do when I was all alone. Oh, Piglet, you gotta be brave. You weren't lonely at all? Lonely? Are you kidding? I'm a Tigger. The most wonderful thing about Tiggers is I'm the only one. But I do admit, friends are awfully fun, too. <laughs> sink, sink, sink. Hey, Pooh. What are you thinking about now? Oh, well, I'm just thinking about um, what to think about. <laughs> well, I'm off. Sora, where are you going? I'm gonna go look for my friends. They're waiting for me. Oh, it's on back again! <laughs> uh, 
I hope you find your friends. forget we shall always be here if you'd like to visit again that is I didn't think you'd come, Sora. <gasps> Good to see you again. Well, where are Donald and Goofy? Are they that important to you? More important than old friends? Instead of worrying about them, you should be asking about her. Kyrie! That's right. While you were off goofing around, I finally found her. Not so fast! No shenanigans aboard my vessel, boy. Riku, why are you siding with the Heartless? The Heartless obey me now, Sora. Now I have nothing to fear. You're stupid! Sooner or later they'll swallow your heart! Not a chance. My heart's too strong. Riku! I've picked up a few other tricks as well. Like this, for instance. You can go see your friends now. Ah! Let's get underway already. And keep Sora away from Kairi until we're ready to land. Hmm. That scurvy brat thinks he can order me around. What shall we do, Captain Hook? Nothing! The hold is crawling with heartless. Let them keep an eye on the brats. But, Captain, you know who is also down... Shh! Did you hear that, me? Oh, that dreadful sound. No, Captain. Are you quite sure? Did I imagine it? Oh, my poor nerves. You don't say. Yeah, it was definitely Kyrie. I finally found her. All right. <laughs> yep, then let's go up and talk to her. Yeah. Sounds good. Okay, but first, how about getting off? Oh, <laughs> sorry. <clears throat> how you doing there? Looking for a way out? Who are you? I'm the answer to your prayers. Ha! <sighs> okay then, fine. Have it your way. But you're stuck in here too, aren't you? Huh. Nope, I'm just waiting for someone. Who? Tinkerbell, what took you so long? Great job. So you found Wendy? Hold on. There was another girl there too? Are you crazy? There's no way I'm gonna leave Wendy there. Aha! Uh -huh. She must be pretty jealous. Come on, Tink. Open up the door. 
<clears throat> I'm Peter Pan. I'm Sora. Okay. We're in this together, but only till we find Wendy. So, uh, how come you can fly? Anyone can fly. You want to try? Aw, uh, haven't you cooled off yet, Tink? Just a little bit of pixie dust. There, now you can fly. So Wendy's not one of the chosen ones? There are seven, supposedly. And Maleficent says she's not one of them. Hoist anchor as soon as possible. Leave all the dead weight behind, including her. After the trouble of capturing her? And why those seven? What is Maleficent planning anyway? Who knows? As long as it means getting Kyrie's heart back, I couldn't care less. <laughs> You're wasting your time. The Heartless have devoured that girl's heart. I'll stake me other hand, it's lost forever. I will find it, no matter what. Uh, Captain? What? The prisoners have escaped. What's more, Peter Pan is with them. <sighs> Blast that Peter Pan. All right then, bring the hostage to me cabin, Smee. Hop to it. What is it, Tink? Peter? Peter Pan? Wendy! Please, hurry! The pirates are coming! What? I'll be right up there. Just hold on! Wendy? Yes? Is there another girl in there with you? Oh, why, yes. But she seems to be asleep. She hasn't budged an inch. Kyrie? Kyrie! Uh. Ah. Oh. Oh. Wendy, hey, let's get up there. Riku, wait. Wendy, come on, Tink, not now. Well. This is as far as I can go. I gotta help Wendy. Quite a codfish, that Riku. Running off with that girl without even saying goodbye. Run off where? Tell me, where did he go? To the ruins of Hollow Bastion, where Maleficent resides. Uh, but you won't be going there. <gasps> Unless you intend to leave your little pixie friend behind. <sighs> Hand over the keyblade and I'll spare your lives. Be glad I'm merciful, unlike the heartless. So, which will it be? The keyblade or the plank? It's him! The crocodile that took me hand! Oh, Smee! He's after me other hand! I can't stay here! Go away! Oh, I can't stand the sight of him! Smee! You take care of them! Fly! 
Try, Sora. Just believe, and you can do it. Thanks, Peter. Hey, don't mention it. You didn't think I'd leave you and Tink behind, did you? Is that you, Smee? Did you finish them off? Aye, Captain. They walked the plank, every last one of them. Peter Blast you! Ready to make a splash, you codfish? Now it's your turn to walk the plank. Kyrie couldn't wake up, so maybe she's really lost her. Shh. <gasps> Sora. I still can't believe it. It really flew. Wait till I tell Kyrie. I wonder if she'll believe me. Probably not. You can bring her to Neverland sometime. Then she can try it herself. If you believe, you can do anything, right? I'll find Kyrie. I know I will. There's so much I want to tell her about flying, the pirates, and everything else that's happened. What's that, Tink? What about the clock tower? You say there's something there. It was reckless to bring her here without at least using a vessel. Remember, relying too heavily on the dark powers could cost you your heart. A castaway. Though his world perished, his heart did not. When we took the princess from his castle, he apparently followed her here through sheer force of will. But fear not. 
No harm will come to you. He is no match for your power. Her power? Yes. The untapped power that lies within you. Now, child, it's time you awakened that power and realized your full potential. Peter, are you really going back to Neverland? Afraid so. But we can see each other anytime. As long as you don't forget about Neverland, that is. <coughs> oh boy, she's getting steamed again. Do me a favor. Look after her for me, will ya? What? 